today it's rainy outside and um, my little girl I think she's having a hard time today because she was a little bit manic running. She just kept running back and forth and like she didn't know what to do with herself. And um, I had to just stop and sit down and like give her love, gave her a little bit of Reiki and just went into the study because um, they're used to being in the study and then they would just sleep because they each have their own chairs. And um, so I just kind of tucked her in here. And so now she's, she's in here and she's just sleeping now. But it's just sad, you know, it's, we're all still dealing with it. And every day it gets a little bit better. Um, I think you start to focus more on just how lucky we were to have this, you know, our beautiful little girl in our life. And you think of how, how beautiful the shared experience was of love, you know, and, and thinking about all the good things and, um, thinking of all her sweet little mannerisms and the things that she did. And I think that in the grief process that starts to take over because there's nothing you can do about the loss. It's, it's a reality. But what you can do is just honor them through the memories. And so that's what we're doing. And every day it gets a little bit easier, you know, but today was her day, you know, Sakara's day. She's still, or Celia's day. She still has moments where uh, she doesn't have energy. Like she doesn't, we take her out to walk and she just doesn't really want to do anything, you know. So today we are just going to be in, it's Friday. I have an appointment today for myself for my eyes and after that well and before that actually I'm, it's rainy outside and today is the perfect day to just sit in my study and work on my book i have two books i'm working on and um one of them is a sequel to the book that's being published so today is the day i'm going to work on that and just sit and love on this little one here so i just wanted to give you guys an update